In this video, I will show you how you can vary a variable. First, we open a new input file by pressing new and clicking on basic. A new input file is created. Then we go on the input tab and we look at the beam card. If I want to vary the momentum in a simulation, I cannot do it directly in the beam card because I can only give one value to the momentum. So I define a new variable by clicking on preprocessor and define. And just for the looks, I put it above the beam card. And I define a variable, let's call it momentum. And I give it a default value, let's say 10. And then in the beam momentum card, I can set the momentum to equal momentum. Make sure this momentum is written exactly the same way as the variable. And then if I click again on the beam card, you see that the momentum is changing to exactly this value that I gave the variable before. If I change it to 100, the number in the beam card is changing as well to 100. Then we go on the run tab. We click on loop, a new window pops up and we can choose the variable that we want to change. I can give a start value, for example 10. I give an end value, let's say 100, and a step size, let's say 10. So I should get 10 different simulations with a momentum of 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80 and 90 and 100 GV. And this is exactly what happened. I just want to mention here that you can also vary over two variables. 